welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to my talk show. I'm your host, the Honorable, again with another interview. This time it's interview 270. This time we're going to be with Choto Dragon joining us momentarily. Hopefully you guys enjoyed tonight's show. I apologize for the wait. Uh, if anybody has any questions, just a reminder, as much as questions in the chat, we'll get to them later on throughout the show. Uh, please type in your username, type in your question, and then we'll uh, get to those questions. But anyway, without further ado, let's introduce our guest coming from behind the curtains, Choto Dragon. Hello, welcome. Welcome, welcome. Yeah, you just sit next to me. Hi. I need to keep... Keep what? Hi. This is going... Is this going to go well? Yeah, it is. What do you mean? It works. See, it only took me a little bit to figure out, you know? It's only gonna get trying to get it perfect. And okay, and I'm so tiny. Listen, the person I interviewed yesterday was literally the size of my foot. Okay, relax. <laughs> All right, they're smaller than that. Okay, this is just big people chairs. All right, and we're in a big world. But anyway, anyway. It's good to finally see you. It's good to finally, you know, have you on the show. You know, that's that's what's important. But yeah, just a reminder, anyone who's watching this in the future, YouTube, or whatever, the the closed captions, the black text, that is what uh, Choto is saying in real time. So yes, this is speech to text. For anyone who's confused, just want to make that very clear uh, for the future. Anyone's watching this, you know, in the distant years to come on YouTube and stuff like that. Allegedly, I mean... I hope so. Basically, yeah, she does have an accent, so obviously it will translate as best as it can. But hopefully, with our collective uh, brain power, we can decipher what you're actually saying. So anyway, fingers crossed. Yeah. So let's let's get right into this interview. So my first question is I always like to ask is uh, how did you come up with your, with your username? You know, how how did you come up with your name, Chota Dragon? I want to know. You know, I think we all want to know what what what's the story behind it. You know, how'd you come up with it? It's really lame. No, you can tell us. What'd you do? I was born in the year of the dragon, and I'm small. And I did it in a very Fine rush. Okay. My friend said let's set up an account, so it did. Okay. And that was VR chat. And then the name was free on Twitch. Sorry. And everywhere else because it's such it's such a silly go on I, I'm I'm pause champing it's such a silly name Vega yes yeah so okay so I managed to get it I managed to get it on all social media Nice. Well, hey, I mean, you know, it's a story, and I mean, you, I think it's a cool name. What do you mean? You said it's lame? What do you mean? I think everyone here thinks it's a cool name. Okay? It's better than being like, what's a stupid username? Pussy Slayer 69 Something like that? It's better than that. <laughs> to be honest. I would have, I would have tried that one, but it's already gone. Oh, yeah, that's true. That one's already taken. You're right. That's a, that's a, <laughs> yeah. Imagine getting partnered. Hey guys, it's me on Twitch, Pussy, Pussy Slayer 69 What's going on? Ready to stream on Twitch. Yeah, that'd be pretty good, yeah. 
LOL. Now here's the question, do you actually say LOL or is you laughing and it just says LOL? <laughs> That's the real question. So I've swapped out words. Oh, okay. Because it doesn't understand everything. Oh, okay. I just wanted to know. I think it'd be funny if it was just like, you're laughing and then it just says LOL. <laughs> like what? So if I make a laughing sound, it will say LOL. Okay, that's nice. Hey, this is technology. Okay. So anyway, next question. That was a, that was a pretty tough first one, you know? Uh, my next question is, how'd you get into uh, a VR chat? You know, how'd you end up in this game? I like VR. And I see I saw some duck and I saw some dance videos. Yeah, you saw some ducks, huh? Panda. And convince. And yeah, the ducks convince. What? The ducks convinced you to play VR chat? What, what duck? Oh. There was no ducks? Oh, so there's no. There was ducks, but now there's none. I get it. Global warming. You know, it's how it is. I get it, right? It's it's a serious issue, right? It's one day there's ducks and one day there isn't, you know? It's just the way life is. That's quite the that's quite the story, you know? Finding some ducks. Makes sense. Okay. So you saw some dance videos. And who are these dancers? Is anyone that still plays VR chat? Any anybody that's in the chat right now? Hey, who are these dancers? Yeah, so there was no logic. Yeah, no logic, David. Yeah, there was. Yeah, that was it, right? That was just. <laughs> There's just nobody else. <laughs> there was thinking. Nexus. So uh, some someone called Courtney. Okay. Someone called Fire. Fire Knight. I think is his name, I, I, Flame Knight, something like that. There's a lot of there. There's lots. Okay. Time frame. Inflamed. Inflamed two. Inflame. Flame. Inflamed two. Yeah. There's a lot of flames. You're right. Yeah. I mean, listen. It's all the ducks. One day there's ducks, and the next day there was no ducks. And then there's no Lodge of David, my homie, my G. And then there's flame, and then flame, flame two. So you're right. I mean, what else dancers are there, right? I I don't know. It, it, you know, was there Ron in that? Ron of two ends or Nachish VR? None of those. Just Flame. Flame two, right? Flame two was where it's at. Is his wrong? Who is Ron? Oh yeah, right. Oh, I was talking about Ron, the guy who developed VR Chat. Yeah, 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 I don't know any Rons with two ends. I don't know who that is. Because that would be weird. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. That's pretty weird. But anyway. Okay, so that's that's how you uh, got into... That's how you discovered VR chat. Did you, uh, did you start in desktop or did you start in VR? Oh, full body? Everything? Damn. What the heck? You just you just saw like no logic David dancing and you're like, damn I want to buy all that stuff. So you bought like what'd you buy the index? You buy the Vive? You just get the money. You're just like, all right. Your mom, your dad was like, what are you buying? You're like, don't question me. I want to be this when I grow up. And, they, and you showed them no logic David and they showed some flaming ducks. And they're like, it just makes sense to me. I just told them uh, I told them drugs. What? You told them drugs. What do you mean? Excuse me? Definitely, definitely not thousands on VIA. What? On VR, VIA VR, what the heck? Drugs. What kind of what kind of drugs you into? What's going on here? I kid, I kid. Oh. Okay. Most of it was donated. All borrowed. Wait, it's so so you got into, so, wait. 
Did you stream before VR chat? Cause like, how did you just had like, or you just had like friends that just gave you VR? They're just like, yo, I don't know who you are, but here's VR. Damn, what the heck? Yo, you got the hook up. I had to do three thousand squats to get my index in full body. What the, what the hell? Damn, I just, man, I need more charisma. I just need to go up to some some homies and be like, yo, give me that VR, bro. Blood. Oh my. Oh, you donated blood. To get money? Oh, it makes sense. They had dragon blood. It makes sense, right? Yeah, yeah. Okay, so that's how you got VR. It's very rare. Yeah, it makes sense. Okay, so that's how you got VR. My housemates play VR. Oh, okay. I know VIA probably means VR. <laughs> yes, and they let me. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. So the real origin story is you lived with some housemates, and, and then you're like... Hey, you're like, hey, I want to play VR too, mom. I mean, for housemate. And they're like, okay. And then they let you. Is it like that? You're like, it's my turn on the VR headset. Yeah, you're like, mine. Gimme, gimme. That makes sense. Okay, so you started playing. What was your first uh, moment while putting on the VR headset in full body? Where you're like, whoa, oh my god. What was your first experience like? Blown away. I'm blown away every time I see you. It's true. Aww. I wish I was sold. You wish you were sold? I, I mean, we can arrange that. You're a real, rare dragon, so we can arrange to sell you to some highest. Yo, chat. Hoover's the top subber tonight. You get Choto Dragon. How about that? I'm being auctioned again? Wait, again? Oh my god. Can't believe it. <laughs> Deal? Yeah, that's right. Currently there is zero bids, so I mean if you if you gift one sub, I mean you get Choto Dragon, so I mean easy clap, right? Damn. So tell me about how, how you were sold the first time. What happened? I think I sold my soul when I started my Twitch. Oh. When did you when did you start streaming? VR chat on a Friday. Ah, oh, of course. On a Friday. I did first stream on a Saturday. Oh, so on a Friday. So like t yesterday, because that was a Friday. Next day, so one day. Yeah, but when was this? Was this like a year ago? Is this 10 years ago? Was this in the 1800s? You have a specific seven months? Seven months ago? Quick chat. What's the math on that? Uh, if it's 11 months, it's uh, January, February, March, April. So that's April like something. April 1st? April Fool's joke? I don't remember. Uh-oh. Dude, she, guys, she has amnesia. She can't remember. Uh oh, I think it's something to do with the auctions. Shit, they gave her amnesia, bro. What the fuck? Come on, chat, chat. You watch, you watch her every day. When did she start streaming? You guys should know. Too many banks. Yeah, I feel that. You guys don't even know when you when you you're supposed to be her her fans, her viewers, her supporters. You can't remember when she first started. April at some point, remember she telling me? Oh man. They bonks SR wow. 10,000 years ago? Even as a mod? Oh my god. I think everyone just has amnesia. They just can't remember. They're just like, I don't know. At some point, this dragon girl just appears out of nowhere. Starts dancing and I just, I just couldn't stop watching. Am I strange that bad people try and blank them out? Oh, it's like Men in Black. You ever watch that movie where they like they have the thing and then they like, and you're like, what? Where was I? Yeah, I feel that every day. Mm. April 11th. Well, there you go. See, one of one of my mods even. <laughs> it took it took all it took my own mod to figure it out. I can't believe that. Damn. Holy shit. But now we know. 
You not coming up the clutch. <laughs> okay. So your first stream was like April 11th. How, how was your first stream? How did it go? Were you dancing? Were you nervous? Were you shy? You were like, oh my God, I never done this before. Like what's, you know, what, what was going through your head? Ever had very loud music and I just danced. Mm. And stupid avatars. Well, what's a stupid avatar? Like Rick and Morty? Avatars or something? Like, I would prefer very, very... If you are... There's no way she would say Knuckles, because she only existed seven months ago. That, not, that means I've been dead for like three years. I won't say the word. Uh, the animal. Oh, the, the furry avatars? The Nanachis. Oh, so you you were a furry when you first started streaming VR chat, and then you became a dragon girl. Hmm, interesting. And l lead lead lewd D and D avatars, oh dungeon and dragon avatars. What the heck? You got some whips and chains or something? What's going on? I don't think that's how you play D and D. I was a raptor. Oh my god! For a while, like a di like a straight up di not even a dinosaur girl, like straight up just dinosaur. Oh my god! What the hell? And and, and half the half the people in the chat right now watched you when they're doing this. What the heck? You went ham in the void. Void club. Damn. So you were a lewd raptor in the void club. That was your first stream. Your old T-Rex hands are like, you know, the best type of raptor. So how did you go from a raptor to uh, a dragon girl? That's, that also contradicts your name. I mean, when you started, you literally called yourself Choto Dragon, but you were a raptor when you first started streaming. Damn, it could have been Choto Raptor. You couldn't find any dragons. Oh, but now you have, so. Find one died was for a while. Yeah, you had to make your own. Do the best thing for VR to make your own avatars. Yeah, you just go in booth, Gumroad, just buy one, slap it together, boom. Instant star, you know what I'm saying? Customers is that easy. Yeah, customize is that easy. Yeah, it's true. Okay. What type of, uh, yeah, make your own. What type of music do you listen to? You just listen to, like, anything? EDM? Do you hate any music? Country? Or, like, ew, country's gross. Would you, would you, would you rock to some, some John Denver? <laughs> do some hip sways? I listen to country. Uh, I wasn't most things. I will listen to mo I will listen to most things. Okay. All right. It was just a test because every time I asked someone like what kind of music they listen to, they said everything but country, and I'm like, what the heck? Listen, they may sing about John Deere's and and beer and and ha mowing the lawn or something, but I mean, hey man, that's just the American dream. You know what I'm saying? My dad will do karaoke to Dolly Parton, so I'm good. <laughs> nice. Now, will you do karaoke to Dolly Parton as well? If my dad is, then I'm in. Oh shit. You ever get you ever get any of your parents into VR? Like your mom or dad? Have you ever got them with the headset on? You'd be like, this is me. Like Elvis? Well, yeah, Elvis is a classic. No. So, do your parents know that, uh, they don't know you stream or do any of this stuff? Oh, shit. My parents know. They think it's rad. They're like, damn. My son's, an, like, this cartoon character. Big Bazongas. <laughs> I'm like, hell yeah. Amen, brother. My dad wants to buy my own body pillow. He wants to sleep with it. True story. Listen, you just, you're just proud of me. Okay. Would you sell a body pillow?
I will. Uh, I'm working on it. Oh, you're working on it. So if your dad buys your body pillow, would you tell him that's you? Or just be like, that's just some random cartoon character, you know? My, I'm not sure my dad knows what the internet is. Oh my god. I mean, my dad's 65. He knows what the internet is. Very old school. Oh, so he's like, uh, he's like, he's like, what's a cell phone? Like, you have to like call him up on the, on the, the home line. He has to go, yeah, you have to like do the old timey, hello? Who's calling? This is the FBI, what do you want? <laughs> this the president? Who's, who's talking? Damn. Yeah, it's like an operator. Yeah, there's like, yo, connect me to uh, line 11, please. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's the old school way. Makes sense. Okay, would you ever tell your parents that you stream at any given time? Even if you're like number one PewDiePie or like whatever. At any point, would you tell them? Be like, hey, this is what I do. Mom, this is what, mom, dad, this is what I do for a living. I dance and go like, do, 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 You know, I, I dance to Dolly Parton. As a anime character. <laughs> I don't know. You don't know. You should just make it a sub goal and just be like, hey guys, if I get like 2,000 subs, I'll do it. Yeah, would you guys want to see that? I'd be so scared. What do you mean? It's your parents. They're the one who brought you up. They should be like, damn, this is what this is what my daughter does. Hell yeah. This is yo, this is dope. Then you could then you could put them in VR and then have them experience VR for the first time. And then you make it a YouTube video and get like 10 million views. <coughs> that's totally not. That's, uh, pff, I don't know what you're talking about. Stonks, yeah. <laughs> Old person tries VR for the first time. It's like Eldos React, you know what I'm saying? Because no one's done that before? Yeah, totally no one has ever done that before. Yeah, but, but it's your dad. They can't take your dad, you know? It's like dad tries playing Fortnite for the first time, you know? That's content. That's true? I guess it's just June. <laughs> yeah, my dad, my six-year-old dad goes goes to the VR, plays VR chat and goes to the Void Club. You're getting good at this? Yeah, it's almost like I've done like 40 interviews with me at some point in the last two years. I guess you could say I've, uh, it's an, it's an acquired, uh, my brain power has just expanded. I just have 10,000 IQ. How do you write that on your CV? UK? You talk with a moose? Can you communicate with me? With meats? Yeah, I like to communicate with meats too. Meat's pretty good. I'm an omnivore. Give me. Oh, okay. Oh, with mutes. You you talk with mutes and can communicate with mutes. Give me. Yeah, I get what you're saying. I uh, you the basically uh, the 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 basically the best way is you just sort of guess everything that they're saying, and if it's wrong, you just keep going. You're just like, oh yeah, you totally want to marry me and like hang out and like have like 10 kids and just want to go on this massive adventure of slaying dragons in VR chat? Hell yeah. And they're like, I'm like, yeah, what do you mean? That's, that would be tough. We got to train and get, a, you know, get buff first. And they're like, yeah, I mean, yeah, true. We should start today, you know? Makes sense. It's that easy, you know? But anyway. My next question was, um, what was the first thing you did when you got in full body? Was there anything specifically you did? Was it just dance? Was it you look at your hands for 20 minutes? Good morning? Yeah, me too. I, I mean, it's only 8 p.m. You know. <laughs> minutes? Yeah, same. I didn't even say anything. They just started putting in things. Yeah. Yeah, good morning, chat. Good morning, everybody. This is a good morning of Rebel here. I was quiet for too long. Long, Yeah. The morning show. That's right. 
Yeah, yeah. The morning show. Yeah, I'd love to do a morning show. What did I do first? Yeah, that's right. What did you do first? I think I just jump worlds like everyone else when they started playing. Okay. Just being like, whoa, this feels so real. And wow, look. Look, I can touch the grass. Because because people tell me to touch the grass every day outside. So I just touched virtual grass. You know what I'm saying? Now I get you. I was like, wow, 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 wow. Yeah, you're like, whoa, oh my god, is that is that Goku from Dragon Ball Z? No way. I can become Goku? Wow, I can become a sexy anime girl? Let's go. Is that how is that how what happened? It goes from ducks, flames, flame two, then uh Goku, and then anime girl. I thought you'd become a sexy dinosaur. I mean, isn't like a dragon a form of a dinosaur? Let's be real. There's literally lizards called bearded dragons, and they're a lizard, and they're t you know. So I guess you could say, yeah, like Godzilla. Like that's a, that's a form of a dragon, kind of. So like you could honestly say that you evolved. Like you're a raptor. It's kind of like you, you ever know like a caterpillar goes into like um, a cocoon, and then a cocoon develops into a beautiful butterfly. You could say that you start off as some. Um, Raptor, which is like a caterpillar, then you then you were, were morphing, and then you became a beautiful butterfly, aka a dragon girl. See, that's the lore. I just wrote it for you. It's it's all true. Write it up. Go guys, come on, go to the VR Chat Legends page. Write up the write up the wiki for. Her. Yeah, I don't have one of those yet. Oh, uh, you just get just just convince some guy in chat to do it. Just be like, yo, I'll give you like a sub if you write up a wiki page for me. Because if you write it yourself, that's kind of lame. But if you get someone else to do it, then like you're like homie. You know what I'm saying? You're like cooler. You don't want to write it yourself. God's boring. Yeah, it feels bad, man. It's okay. You know, one day you'll get it. I mean, honestly, someone should be taking notes right now. Like, listen, we're, we're explaining all your origin stories. Everything is going on. Someone should be typing this up on their typewriter right now. And he says some of Poet. Like, X-Men. Yeah, X-Men was pretty dope. That was, a good, that was a good franchise. Marvel is cool, right? Okay. Well, anyway, so how did you, uh, how did you meet Valkyra, Ron, Nini, and all the free crew? All the dancing. How did how did that happen? So Val is in there, where is probably sleeping. Oh, she's over behind stage sleeping. Okay, yeah. Okay. Yes, and and. Koro wrong. Ron, yeah, Ron, run, run. Yeah, we meet run, run. Okay, and and Jordan. Okay, yeah, we have we have Val, Kuro, Rong, Run Run, and Jordan. Game Pie. Okay. So how'd you meet Run Run and Jordan and Kuro and Val? What they'll come past? Okay, they appeared in my chat. Oh shit! So you're streaming as a raptor, like this. And then they came in your chat and they were like, yo, you're a pretty sexy dinosaur. You want to hang out? Is that how it worked? They appeared in my chat and they paid him myself. So they, wait, they paid themselves to visit you. Damn, holy shit. I know they had to pay you to pay themselves. What, what the hell? That's pretty cool. I'm pretty sure that's how it went. Well, they have to sub. That They have to two subs, so they either did pay. They had to pay subs to pay, like, to hang out with you? Oh, shit. God damn. I mean, you had, did totally have to pay me $1,000 to be in this talk show. So, I mean, I feel that. True story. <laughs> damn. I think you, I think you, yeah. You gotta pay that. Is gonna pay that? Yeah. So, they appeared in your chat. And they were just like, yo, what's hang well, they were like, yo, you got some cool dance moves. And they sort of like, yo, wanna hang out? And you're like, amen. You gotta pay me first though. 
Minion Socks can't pass first, I think. You mean like Socks VR? K U R O. Peter join. Asked me to join. Yo, I know Peter. Peter Peter Griffin, right? Yeah, he's pretty cool. Carol Stinky. Yeah, that's pretty true. Yes, Family Guy. So you know Family Guy? Giggity giggity. What the what the hell? Are you Quagmire? Are you Quagmire right now? Oh my god, I didn't know Quagmire played VR chat. I'm learning so much today in this interview, I'm gonna be honest. Apparently you know Peter Griffin, you know socks, like the things you wear on your feet. Mm. Okay. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's that's how you spell it. Yeah, it's yeah, true. Okay. Sorry, Socks. That's okay. Any favorite moments you had while hanging out together with, with like Ron and Nini and, and Val and all of them? Any any memorable moment moments? So many. It's been amazing. This guy is so cool. The guys is so cool. They all dance really well. So friendly. There's Jack as well. Well, everyone's, they're all been really welcoming. Jack's. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's Jack's. Oh, I know, like, Black Jack's. Yeah, I know, yeah. I know. <laughs> So I'm deciphering things. I mean, as well, they all just been pulled. I mean, pulled? I mean, chat is pog. Yeah, that's pretty true. Chat is pog. You guys chat, you're pog? Really welcoming. Like VR chat. Video chat. Like VR chat. Like VR chat, video chat. Yeah, where's video chat at? I wanna play video chat. Heart attack? <gasps> you had a heart attack? Oh my god, what the hell? Yo, what the- Don't have a heart attack? Holy- Dude, someone- Someone called the, the, the VR chat staff. She's having a heart attack. Get socks in here. They need to help you out. I will see. So VR chat. Chat. Is the best chat. Mmm. Makes sense. VR chat chat is the best chat. Like they're very chilled. They want a party. They want to party. They want to have, they want to have fun. Okay, yeah. So they want to have fun and they engage with you and they're like, oh my God, Chodo Dragon, let's let's party, let's dance, let's hang out. Let's, let's show our dance moves. Like it's really, it's really, really back and forth. Mm. Nice for you as a st streamer to have that. I'm a stream stim stimmer as well. Stimmer. Any else a stimmer in here? <laughs> See ice gems, dice. Fat guy steams what? What? Fat guys. What about fat guys steams what? Stupid Asian accent. Sorry. It's okay. Fat guy fat guy steams. It's okay. Yeah. It's alright. Yes, exactly. Okay. I'm going on the on the record of that. Yeah. Fat guy steams what? Stems what? Yeah, you you can quote me on that. Yeah, it'll be in your VR chat legends page. We'll make sure it gets done. <laughs> okay. What uh what 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 convinced you? That's been really good. Yeah. What convinced you to start streaming? Was it your friends? Was it just watching No Logic David? We were just like. Just them, like, because I, I asked, like, how'd you get into VR chat? You said that was because, like, Knowledge David, but also was streaming the same reason? No. So I didn't really understand what streaming was. 
Yeah, me neither. I still don't. <laughs> I don't know. I just kind of, yeah. I just, I just play it. Just felt like you were supposed to. Supposed to, yeah. On YouTube streaming, it. That was kind of the part of it. Oh, so you watch YouTube streaming, and you're like, oh, I could stream on Twitch instead, because that's superior, right? Instruments, yeah. And then this happened. Okay. Makes sense. I've been doing it for seven months. Yeah, well, in five months, you're going to have your, uh, your one-year anniversary. you got to celebrate. So you're gonna get a drink. It's sippy time. That's fine. I take drinks. Yeah, I'm talking a lot, you know. You gotta, you gotta lubricate your your mouth, you know. You gotta make sure you can speak. Everyone take uh, take some sips from your drinks. Make sure you're uh, drinking a lot of water. Stay hydrated. Cheers. Tap. Yeah, I mean I can I can tap. Watch this. Look at this. Okay. Whew. Okay. So how did you create your OC? Like your dragon girl, how did that come to be? Were you just, were you always into dragons or was that just something that you wanted to do or how how did this character come to be? You said like the raptor stuff, but I like I want a more, more in-depth answer. Was it just you always wanted to be a dragon, then you just eventually found something you liked, and then customize it? What's it? Why dragons? You could be anything. You could be a strong, independent uh, Dolly Parton fan, you know. So why dragon girl? That's chat's fault. So my lore developed through chat. Okay, so chat decided that you had to be a dragon girl. They could have made you anything else. They could have made you a cat girl. They could have made you like a, a dragon boy. You'd be the first one. <laughs> do you want me to be a dragon boy chat? I mean, all you have to do is, you know, get a bulgy walgy and then basically you're a dude. So I mean, like, you know. Is that what you guys want? Is more my name is Dragon, so that makes sense, I guess. Yeah, I guess it wouldn't make sense if, if like, they made you into, like, a wolf girl and your name was Choto Dragon. Like, that actually wouldn't make sense. I guess. Unless, you, unless you're a dragon, dragon fox girl hybrid. Ooh. I watched that movie. Yeah, you you'd be starring in it. Let's go. That's right. Okay, so so Hollywood, yeah, absolutely. So um, so how'd you get into dancing? Were you always a dancer growing up as a kid, or is this something you got into recently? Recently, no, no. So. Yeah, there's ads. I'm sorry, guys. You gotta sub with Twitch Prime or normal subs to get rid of ads. I know it's just Twitch. Sorry. Uh, I basically started dancing on VR India. Oh, India VR, nice. Heck yeah, twenty only twenty seconds. I get it. Yeah, VR India. You know, it's a little different than VR chat. I think I'm scared to dance IRL. What do you mean? If you can dance in VR chat, you can dance in VR. So I tried Justin VR. Yeah, Justin VR. Just in VR. So if you watch my original rods, you mean VODs? Yeah, but I can't because they're auto-deleted after like two months. 
Unless they're posted on YouTube somewhere. You see how bad I am to save them all? What do you mean? You've been doing it for seven months. Now, listen. You're you're better than I will ever be. I can't dance. Because I got a bad back. So I'm, like, crippled. So. Yeah. Thanks to Ron. Thanks to Ron. Yeah, Ron from VRChat. He's pretty cool. In Euro. Yeah, Europe. Shout out to the EU crowd, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, cuter. Yeah. Oh, thanks. Oh, you complimented me. I appreciate it. The dancing community Aww. has taught me. Me like Jordan? Like Michael Jordan? Mmm. Listen, he knows how to play basketball, but he'll teach you some dance moves. <laughs> He's got a meeting step. We got rhythm. Yeah, yeah. Makes sense. Okay. So this is uh, going to journey, going to be a journey for me. Yeah, you'll learn. You learn how to do those hip sways, and after that, you took over the internet. I mean, let's be real. You know, people will inspire to be like you, Choto Dragon. 100%. People want to be just like you. They're like, wow, she's such an incredible person with her amazing dancing moves, and those hips don't lie. Listen, my eyes are up here, chat. Okay, pay attention. You know? And, and they just... They, <laughs> They're, they're just getting lost in, in all your dance moves. You're confusing them and their wallets are emptying. They're like, what's going on? Where's all my money? What the hell? Choto just took all my money. What the hell? Sorry, not sorry. Oh, shit. True. Yeah, sorry, not sorry, chat. It was a robbery. Oh, your stonks increased. That's right. So the dancing men fun? Yeah. You said you said it right. Why did you check? You said it right. Why why did you change the text? Oh, I didn't hack into the text. Trust me. It changes. He's doxing. Wait, wait, am I? No. What are you talking about? I didn't do anything. Headache. That's not true. Uh, you actually scared me for a second. I thought something else was showing. <laughs> I was like, oh shit. <laughs> no, I didn't touch anything. It's on my other monitor that I don't touch. You, you, you made me worried for a second. Anyway. Uh, do you think that you, you would be where you are today with streaming? Yeah, you're seven months in. Do you think you'd be where you are now, you know? I forgot to thank Anachi. I need to use big pot. Mm, the big pot. Part. Okay. So yeah. Yeah, you need to use the big pot. So yeah, the community. Yeah, the big pot has got me to wherever I am today. <laughs> I use pig pot to cook pasta. True. <laughs> has got to where I am. <laughs> Meaty big pot as well is as being very helpful. You like a big meaty pot? Like big, you like a big pot? Like, a, like look, how big? Like this big? This big, this, this big. Super sized, all the parts. Mm. I feel that, makes sense. Josh, your yours okay, buddy? Oh. I'm gonna fight text. 
Whoa. Don't fight the text. Okay. So my next question is, uh, is there anything that you haven't experienced in VR chat that you want to do? Anything that you're like, oh, I really want to do this. Wireless? Oh, you want to try wireless? And just better everything? I want more. It just makes you hungry for more. We're you talking about the big pots, so it makes sense. Makes you hungry. <laughs> I'm hungry, always hungry. My motto is never content. Mm. I feel that. There's never enough content, you know? There's not, there's not enough content. You're always hungry for more. Yeah, it makes sense to me. Okay, so you want to have wireless. You mean like vi wireless like Vive? Or do you want wireless like Index? Because my Index is wired. Yeah, yeah it'll, it'll come out soon. I don't know. In a year or two, it will. Yeah, then you do backflips. Do you want to do backflips? That would be Pog. Yeah, Pog. It would be pretty Pog, wouldn't it? Do you have any... uh uh? Interesting game like a pole, you know, like pole dancing. I see a lot of pole dancers, you know, it's really good exercise Okay, it's very good exercise. It works at your core. It works at your legs You know, that's how you get strong. That's how you get thick thighs The lights I'm gonna get one I'm gonna get the pole. Yeah, there you go You have to get uh, what is it that people use like baby powder or something you get baby put on your hands So then you don't hurt yourself, you know, you, don't, you know yeah, yeah. I want a DJ in VR. I mean, I could hook up some DJs. So you want to be pole dancing. And then what we can do is you can, on your avatar, have a toggle. So then you spawn a pole and then you, you calibrate it with your real life pole. And then you, and then you pole dance. That's pretty cool. I have this. Yeah, you have the... Yeah, I need some drinks and this after this interview, you know what I'm saying? Wait, there is a pole over there. What the fuck? Holy shit. Look, it's a pole. How'd you get that? I thought you were going to get one. What the hell? They can't see it because it's fucking over there, but... Oh, look. The pole's right there. You already have one. What are you talking about? The pole's right there. Can I borrow when the cameras go off? Yeah, the after there's Listen, there's a lot of stuff that happens in the after interview. You know what I'm saying, Chad? You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. We'll, we'll drink. We'll, we'll take that the whole bottle. We'll drink it. You know? Yeah. Okay, so you want to you wanna get wireless and you want to get a pool. And do, go, go more adventures and stuff. Okay. That sounds pretty solid to me. Where do you see yourself in the coming year? And, and a one, oh yeah, and a DJ. And you want a DJ. Anything, you, do you, is there anything that you want? Uh, where do you see yourself in the coming year? Sorry, that was the question. I like to grow my little community into a big pot. The fans. Fancy car. You want a fancy car? Holy shit. You gonna buy like a Porsche? God damn shit. I don't know if your chat streamer is making 200,000. God damn. We can afford a 2022 Porsche. Holy fuck. Purple Lamborghini. Yeah, that's right. I have a community channel that I won't say the name of. <gasps> Uh-oh. What well, happens in the secret stuff? Well, cars and chat. That Val... Well, Val, Kara, and chat. That Val and chat has said the name. <gasps> Uh-oh. The fan one. 
Uh oh. I'm not gonna repeat the second word, they'll never know. Thanks guys, that's where we play Minecraft. Oh my, you play Minecraft? Oh my, are you gonna be Dream? Are you gonna beat up Dream? Are you gonna get the world record? Holy shit. <laughs> yeah, cause I won't cheat. Oh shit! Woo! Damn! True! Oh my god. Holy shit, you just roasted him, dude. Damn. Holy fuck. Come at me, Dream. Yeah, I want to see that. Dream versus Chodo Dragon. Yeah. Wiggle off. Yeah, I want to see Dream in VR chat. You, you get to dance battle him. He can't cheat in dancing. That's right. That's where you have to show your real skills. VR Minecraft? Ooh, true. You can play VR Minecraft too. Yeah, just make sure you delete your mod folder. You know, just make sure you delete the mod folder, right? Just you know, make sure you don't <laughs> don't leave your mods on to, that, that uh, edits the calculations. Yeah, no one will know. Yeah. Am I jump? Am I jump cuts? Oh yeah, yeah. Just yeah, just just make sure the jump cuts are really you know good. Makes sense. Okay. Okay, so school, it's cool. Yeah, it makes sense. Are you having fun so far? Are you enjoying this? Yeah, okay, I just wanna make sure. I'm just vibe checking, you know what I'm saying? Just vibe checking, make sure. No, I want to try one thing. What do you wanna try? Going to try and get a racing, get my racing. Like a racing car in VR. Ooh, there are maps you can race in this game. Like you have to actually use full body like to hit the gas pedal and stuff. I want to do something more real. It's very cool. Oh, do you want to get like one of those, um, the, those like racing setups, like the IRL one with the steering wheel and the pedals, but you're in VR. Yeah, I think I've seen someone do that. It was like $10,000. Some shit like that. It was like super expensive because they had VR. They had to have a supercomputer. They had to have like the steering wheel, the gear, gear shift, and the mirrors and shit. Damn. You wanted to race people, and then and then you could like mod it so then like it's you your avatar, and then people are like what the hell? I just got beat by a dragon girl. What what the hell? And he'd be like, yo, pink slip or not, bro? Listen, bro, ten thousand dollars. Put it down on this match, or give me your car. Ooh, I can see that. My dragon wings against your skyline. Yeah, that feels about right. Avatars, that's funny. Yeah. Pink slip avatars. Yeah, I mean, you can make an avatar into a car, so you can be like, yo, I yoink that car. That, that, that avatar is mine now, bro. That GTR is mine. That Porsche is mine. Lamborghini, mine. Yoink. You know, I don't think anyone's ever done this before, but I'm just going to throw a random idea. They should have, like, actual organized racing in VR chat and, like, have, like, a whole RP thing about it. Kind of like Fast and the Furious. Yeah, there's racing outside of VR chat, but I'm talking about like in VR chat. So you have like your, like you basically just role play Fast and the Furious, but in VR chat. <laughs> You're like, yo, cuz, yo, I'm gonna race your car, bitch. You know, you like, you race them and stuff. Yeah. I don't have friends, I have family. Yeah, it's true. Family, it's where it's at. Aww. I feel that. At least you got family. That's all you need to overcome anything. Just family. You don't need to be strong or tough. You just gotta have your family behind you and you just easy clap, you know? You're racing for family, yeah. Makes sense. Okay. Uh, my next question. Um, have you, you, I saw in some titles you've been doing role play. You're a role player now? Doing some role play stuff? 
a small amount. Okay, how's that been going? This is always part of the room when the stream. It's part of the story? Oh. It's part of the story so we know we play. It's mainly like music and dance, but when it's needed. It helps just fun. And his stupidity. Oh. So what kind of silly RP have you done? Like dinosaur stuff? We have a story where myself and my sister uh, are going to be slain by the Valkyrie. Oh, shit. That's not cool. Is she going to come out of nowhere like halfway through the interview and just try and murder you? Damn. She's not too smart. Oh. She gets distracted? Yeah, I distract my chat all the time. So she ends up dancing with us? Oh. Well, it makes sense. So she's like about to like shank you and then she's like, oh wait, let's jam. Yo, like that? Oh, makes sense. Makes sense, okay. What if you just like, cause you're a dragon, you can breathe fire. We just like breathe fire on her. You're like, you know, do one of these, you know, um, <clears throat> Or is it like this? Go like, whoo, like that. Yeah, it's not to confirm kind of dragon I am. Like ADC is a water dragon. Oh, so they do like this. Uh, oh God, where is it? Yeah, They're like this. They're, it's like a Pokemon. It's like water beam. Water blast, water gun. Ah, there you go. <laughs> it's water gun. <laughs> Super effective. You could be a fire dragon. You could be an ice dragon. I mean, you're like blue teal, so it makes sense if you're an ice dragon. But you know, you could be a fire dragon, ice dragon. You know, electricity. You know, you, you can choose some little snowflakes like that. You know. Yeah, water, ice. You can you shoot little blizzards at people. Would you say you're a shiny? Like you're like that rare? Like you're a shi you're a shiny dragon. You know, like Pokemon, like super rare, like one in a million. That's up to my chat. No, you should say I'm legend. I'm legendary as fuck. Mewtwo ain't got shit on me. I'm a fucking legendary shiny ice dragon, Choto dragon. Listen, if you want me, bro, you gotta you gotta pay up, bro. You gotta empty out your bank account to be like me. You know what I'm saying? That's what you should be saying. I'm too uh. I'm too amazing and modest to say that. Yeah, true. I'm pretty amazing too. You just say it's role play. Just say you're role playing, by the way, and you get away with anything. <laughs> I'll be the best of all time. <gasps> I'm the goat, the greatest of all time in RP. Oh, nice. RP jail free card. Yeah, has, there, has Val ever put you in the jail cell? You had to get, get out of jail? Get out of jail free card? Yeah, have they ever, like, put you in the jail? And you had to dance in jail? And you're just like, do, 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 do. And then they get distracted and they drop the keys. It's like, oops, I dropped my keys. Oh, let's dance too. And then you yoink the key and you get out of jail. Is that how that happened? One time? Twice? Damn. Val's lacking, you know? She can't remember the amnesia. She can't remember that happened twice. Makes sense. 
Nice. Val's not too smart. But she's super cute. Oh, I mean, that makes up for it, right? Because it's... <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Aww. And people that seem to like her. I don't know why. Yeah, yeah, I don't know why people <laughs> like her. Yeah, I don't know why people like her either. I don't know. Maybe we'll find out when I bring her on for an interview. Maybe we'll figure that out. Turn volume down. I never said that. What do you mean? Closed captions will never lie. What are you talking about? Valves likes my childhood friend, so it's difficult to draw the line and not have some so much banter. Yeah, Val, Blake Gaben. Makes sense. You might mean Val, Val Cara. <laughs> I'm not sure everyone, I'm not sure everyone gets it. So they have to. Oh, that's why you use the RP card. You just say, oh, we're just role playing, by the way. So everything we just said, it was just fabricated in a, in a joking manner. See, that's why you just say you're role playing and you literally get away from anything. You know, you're robbing a bank to say, hey, I'm just role-playing, bro. I'm just role-playing, bro. Relax. Calm down. And it's that easy. Yeah, just say RP, by the way. After every sentence, just say RP, by the way. And it works. Seven people are happy. Oh, yeah, I'm one of them. R&B. R&B. RP. Yeah. Makes sense. BP, very difficult letters. Yeah. RP. Makes sense. ERP. It's in the game. What? Yeah, I have to raise my mods. Yeah, you want to raise them? You want to beat them up? It was a uh, subathon goal. Hey, Sabath uh, Sabathoth? So, Sabbath. Oh my God. Isn't that a, isn't that a band? <laughs> yeah, that's pretty cool. <laughs> hey, a subathon. It was a Black Sabbath girl. Black Sabbath girl. What's going on with the Black Sabbath girl? What's going on? So so I'll be racing them soon. Oh shit. Yo, got any bets, chat? Miami experiences Mario Kart. Yeah, you can race in Mario Kart. You know, I'm actually generally surprised that like Mario Kart isn't like in VR. Like, why is why is Nintendo not on the VR games? You know what I'm saying? Like, they should literally just make Mario Kart VR. Like, who would not want to play like you're like this and you're like. Throw some turtles at some people. You just use VR and just chuck it like this. Play me later. I don't even have any Nintendo games. I I, I really don't own a single. I've only owned a PC and VR. I I got nothing. Then does that Labo cardboard VR thing? Yeah, but they need to like, get like an index, bro. They need to get the high high stuff. You know, get the good VR stuff. Mario Tennis, Mario Golf, Mario Kart, so many options. Uh, you named, like, all the things you just named have Mario in them. <laughs> Where's the non-Mario games at? <laughs> Nintendo is just Mario this, Mario that, man. Where's Luigi at, huh? Huh? Where's Luigi at? They don't see VR as a moneymaker yet? Bullshit. Listen, dude. They, I bet you right now Nintendo's quivering in their little boots. They're like, oh my god, Mark Zuckerberg is a fucking billionaire of his Oculus Quest 2, man. We should make our own things, man. Zelda, Zelda Tennis, Zelda Golf. Mmm, yeah, Zelda. Because <laughs> Val? You mean the uh, stream or the Steam Deck? Which is Nintendo Switch. Yeah. 
But apparently the Steam Deck or yeah is uh, delayed until 2022. It's just a portable PC at this point. But I'm not getting it because I mean I already got a computer. I already sit like 10 hours a day on the computer. I don't need a Switch. I get you know. You can play VR on it. I have the emails because I travel. Yeah, I don't travel. I'm I'm a hermit. But if you travel, it makes sense. That's what I said when when I first heard about it. If if you're someone who travels, the Steam Deck makes sense, like a Nintendo Switch, right? You carry it with you. I don't travel at all, so I, I don't. I'm not gonna get it. I mean, if I travel all the time, like go to like TwitchCon or some shit, maybe. Small form factor computer. Oh, oh, you got like a small like mini laptop. Yeah, like a, like a, what's it called? The uh, MacBook Air. Yeah, those things, are those things like 12 inches or something? They're like really tiny. You get little baby ones. Well, it's an actual PC. Oh, it's like a little baby computer. Oh yeah, like the, like the box. Like the tower is really tiny. My, my mom has one of those. Like the, her computer is like this big. <laughs> but it has everything in it. Also, holy shit, dude. My computer is like 10 times that size. Here's the beast, though. Oh. Shoebox. Damn. That's compact as hell. You just carry that with you? You're just like, all right, I'm going to go to the hotel. Here's my... What's in the box, bro? Is that a bomb? They're like, no, it's my fucking computer, bro. Relax. <laughs> it's my 39th backup. You have 38 other computers? Holy shit. God damn, you're rich as fuck. You got racing cars, Lamborghinis, Porsches, 39 computers. God damn, what the fuck? Holy shit. That's a lot. Can't believe it. Can I have one of them? Please. You can have number 40. Oh, hell yeah. Let's go. Big stonks. Yeah, invest now. Dude, are you are you planning on going to TwitchCon at all? TwitchCon EU, TwitchCon A and A, any of that stuff? Or you, no interest, or like maybe? Not sure. Not sure to be confirmed. So uh, basically, the real answer is uh, if you if you take a picture of Choto Dragon and then you print it out, and you make a little chibi version, and you stick it on your wall at TwitchCon, it should be there. In spirit. Virgin and sticking on your wall? What? Oh, virgin. And sticking on your wall should be all oh, I'm employed somewhere to hold a laptop and then I can watch it through the laptop. Oh, you mean like uh one of those like uh Segway things. They put like this they put like the tablet <laughs> on like the little like cart and you're like, hey guys, what's up? And you're like in VR chat, you're like, hey guys, you go to the VR chat meetup. And you're just on a laptop. You're like, hey guys, it's me. I'm at the VR chat meetup. Oh my god. I should do that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I could, yeah, I could be there. The spirit. There's no keys to the toilet. Food store is expensive? Yeah, that's how they make their money. It's true. Apparently, uh, Twitch London is going on right now, if anyone's from uh, London, England. So, all the all the Twitch, all the, all, the, all the UK boys, and have a cup of tea. I mean, they drink a lot of tea in the UK, right? So, yeah, any, any, anyone from, anyone here watching from London, England? Nobody? Oh. I don't know who even went. I think it was just like probably like Wolfon or something. Wolfon. Um, any of the UK people probably went. I didn't even know they did Twitch uh London. Interesting though. Reminders: one person have a cup of tea. Yeah, of course. If they didn't have a cup of tea, man, they'll be they'll get cr pretty cranky. And chips, yeah. And chips in uh, in the UK is uh, French fries. It's the opposite. 
fish and chips, mate. I haven't had fish and chips in like a year. There's a place that was just down from my parents. That was like the best chips, the fish and chips ever, dude. Hell yeah. Though I've heard in the UK, when they make uh, fish and chips, the, the fish is like, the batter is like thicker. So if you're into like thick batter, then uh, that's what they do, I think. I prefer, like, I, I prefer probably th like, think better if you like it thick. Oh, do you like being thick? I'm pretty thick. Listen, thick thighs save lives. Thigh highs are mine to mine, you know what I'm saying? Oh, there's a Fillion. lot of you. <laughs> oh, shit. That's okay. Fillion with the rate I of 202. All of you at once. Oh, shit. Yeah, what up, what up, Fillion's viewers? What up, the fruit snacks? This is a stick up. Oh, shit. Put your. Dude, Fillion's about to shoot us. Listen. Oh, shit. Yo, Fillion, don't shoot me, okay? I'm interviewing Choto Dragon. She's a mute. And then the closed caption that you see below is her voice. It's true. Don't shoot. Hi, Italian. The closed cap. <laughs> hi, 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 Italian. Yeah, that's Fillion's name. What's up, Italian? How you doing? <laughs> By the way, so the reason why the closed captions, so everyone's on the same page here. The reason why they're kind of like inaccurate is because uh, Chota Dragon has, has an accent. So uh, they're a little, they're a little, little off, but I'm doing my best to translate. Send my apologies. Adidas, hey, Adidas is pretty cool. Like Adidas? Yeah, oh shit, you got Adidas shoot. Oh shit. Wait, 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 in that camera, you don't have shoes on, but I can see you have shoes. What the fuck? Wait, look at, look at your real foot. Look, you have a shoe? And then in the camera over there, you don't. What the fuck? Yo, <laughs> apparently uh, this camera is anti-Adidas. <laughs> it doesn't show your shoes. <laughs> the camera doesn't like that. Yeah, the shaders are broken. Set my sponsor deal is ruined. Fuck. That's pretty weird. Like the camera's got a thing for fee, I guess. There goes my socks. Stonks? Oh, yeah, true. Anyway, if, uh, all you guys are tuning in, if you haven't already hit the follow button. Also, if you have any questions, just a reminder for Choto Dragon or myself, please type in the chat as mission play questions. We'll be getting to those very soon. Camera's a foot fetish? Yeah. Yeah, listen. Listen, the camera's a little weird. They like feet. It's kind of, it's whatever. Let's take a good example make your own avatars. We get foot content for free? That's right. They always scuff, but it's fun. Mm. Makes sense. They're always scuff, but it's fun. And I learn a lot. Yeah, I mean, you're learning a lot, you know? I'm learning a lot today, too, about flames and Ron. And about yourself, <laughs> dragons. I learned a lot today. All right, chat. I think we'll take some questions from the chat. What do you guys think? Run, run. Yeah, run, run. So we'll take some questions. Disgusting. Ew, you don't like chat? I never said that. What the heck? Why would you call chat disgusting? I never said that. What the heck? The cursed dragons. The first dragons. The cursed. No, no, cursed. Cursed. Uh, dude, she's casting a spell on us. What, what the hell is going on here? Anyway, we'll take these chat questions. So the first question we have here is from Chat Meister. What made you decide to stream? Yeah, why did you decide to stream? Stream. Let's be real. I asked that question like an hour ago, but you know what? What really decided? <laughs> what really got you into streaming? <clears throat> what really got you decided? You know, cast dragons. They're pretty disgusting. Yeah, I agree. So what? What really got into streaming? Play housemates. 
my my housemate set it up and I just had to I just had to play it is kind of boring I didn't really think about it yeah it's true streaming is pretty boring right I don't I still don't you just push and then people come and talk to you yeah you just press the button that's honestly that's the easiest step just press go live and then you you know and that's how you stream I mean that it is true and all the other stuff yeah you gotta get stream elements you know you gotta get all that stuff not stream laps <coughs> that company's whack but um yeah you just get you know just hit go live and engage yeah, yeah, it's true. And then seven months later, you can be like Choto Dragon, right? That's how it works. And then have fun, right? Yeah. Yeah, see? It just works. It just works. Easy, easy. All right, next question. Bill Lancer asked the question. Uh, Choto, what do you consider is the most important for streaming? Yeah, I low camera why is low camera angle what the hell what kind of how low are we talking here like feet cam what, what kind of low camera angle are we talking about here not cuz low oh not cuz 20 not TOS not toast not TOS not TOS Ikea by kid. Ah. So you mean like, do you mean like a low angle where like the camera is like lower than you? Or do you mean like a high angle where it's just pointing down at you? Because you do different things. I, p I think people should pay more attention to what they're showing. Yeah. True. They're showing, they're showing the wiggles. What do you mean? Cinematography. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> Because I like what you like to watch and your button. Yeah, I mean like the the best angle is uh it's called the money shot, you know. You get you get you get the you get the camera is where my hand is and it's pointing downwards. You're looking down upon the person and you see the whole avatar. I can't show the angle because I have to do things. Words, yeah. Cause it's like we like to watch panicking and you're trying to talk and you're trying to do everything. Yeah creeping the most important thing the important thing is just do it uh, you'll learn on the job that's true the fun and don't copy anyone your own thing make sure it's yeah just make sure it's yeah make sure it's you yeah I mean just have fun with it you know I think, I think, um, as long as you're having fun, that's all that matters, right? You know, that's, you know, there's a lot of dancers in VR chat. I'm sure half of them are probably in my chat right now. And I'm sure all you guys have fun, right? You guys have fun together, right? You dance, you do some like, what's it called? What's that word? Fuck. I forget what it's called. It's like, a. There's a word for it. It's where like the dancers get in the circle and then like one goes in and goes, you know, what's that? Fuck. Cypher, yeah, there you go. See, I learned that word. I didn't even know what the hell that was until like a couple months ago. They're like, dude, we're ciphering. And I was like, what the hell does that mean? Is that like cybering? I was like, is that ERP? They're like, no. <laughs> yeah, ciphering, yeah. I'm the worst dancer compared uh, to the other guys. Like, I'm learning so much and I'm so nervous. What do you mean? You just You just wiggle and then you just automatically win. Dusty is just amazing. You mean Dust Bunny? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. And me and Dusty are in the same dance group, and Dusty's on like this level. Okay, yeah, yeah. She's on this level, and then you're up here with the wiggles. I get it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. She's down here. You're up here. <laughs> I get it. I wish. Oh, so what you're saying is you're down here, but she's up here. 
Like, you're, you're down here, she's up here. You know, you can fill this gap, you know? You just gotta, you gotta get that skill gap. That's the good thing is you can always get better. True, like how I'm getting better at understanding mutes and in doing interviews. It's also the same thing. See, so yeah, we're all working towards something. Yeah, always improving. So, does that mean like, uh, you know, Dust Bunny is a, is a belly dancer. You're gonna do some belly dancing? You do that stuff? That's what she does. She's a, dance She's a teacher. You couldn't stay away, huh? Yeah, thanks for that two Keep months. Keep coming back for Egyptian. more, I see. Thank you, bye. Egyptian underscore you by just resubscribed for two months. Yeah. Belly dance club. Yeah, I'm telling you. Listen, you got to have the belly dancing uh, collab, and then you have to have the damn bones on the stomach, so then you see, like, it jiggle, you know? That's all about, right? And then you have the little... No, no, no. You got to have the belly dancing outfit, right? Like, on your avatar, and then you unmute, and then you hear, like, the... You know, you hear, like, the little... The little bells, yeah, that's immersion. How did baby come out? Yeah, how are, I don't know how babies are born, so I don't know. How are they born in VR chat? <laughs> Just wake up one day and you're like, whoa, I'm an anime girl, what the fuck? Belly dance club, uh, how to show the wiggles, forum for immersion, nice. Yeah, I mean, listen, if you wanna be fully immersed, Chodo, you gotta have this outfit IRL, or when you're doing belly, you gotta have the belly dancing outfit. If all like, they have like all the rings and like all like the bells and stuff. That's next level. You can't just for a headset on. Yeah, you have to have the whole thing. What, like, come on, there's so many people in VR chat that have like the collar. Do you have a bell collar? You can be honest with me. No one else is listening. <laughs> I do not yet. I do not what? No, like a bell call. You know. You ever, you ever experience, like, I have a lot of people in VR chat, they have, like, the collar, and then it has, like, the little, it's like a little cat collar, right? And then it goes, like, doo -doo 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 -doo, you know, like. Thanks for coming over to me. Do you like Yo, Ron. Ooh -ooh. With two N's. And a seven. Thanks so much for the raid. Wait, Ron was typing my chat also streaming? Damn, multitasking earlier. Like, pets? No, I'm not talking about pet play. What the hell? Why can't you just have a collar? What's wrong with that? Yeah, Ron doesn't really pay attention to his stream. <gasps> That's not good. That's bad. You gotta pay attention. Exposed dragon. Pet play. No, we're just asking. We're, we're asking if Chodo, she wants to have, like, we're talking about, you know, belly dancing. And we're like, yo, you should have one of those collars. So then, like, every time that, uh, you know, you dance, you hear, like, the little bell collar. Like, go, like, doo -doo -doo -doo, you know. I don't stream. Yeah, me neither. This is just uh, a dream I have right now. My chat, if they want me to wear a collar. All right, chat, do, come on, you guys, do you want to have Chodo wear a collar? And every time she dances, you hear like a little bell. Down the voice reel, they want to color a little. Oh, you don't have to talk. You can just unmute and just hear the bell. That's it. That's all they'll ever hear. <laughs> and then they'll then then you do Morse code with the with the bell. And they're like, oh, what what, what are they saying? Have her wear some pants. Wait, you don't wear pants? Color reveal? No, no, no pants allowed. Pantsy's bad. Oh. Pant. Sue. Bad. You don't like pants? Uh, panties? Pantsu? Panties are bad? Only commando up in here, right? Holy shit! <laughs> she said, yeah. What? Commando? I thought that was a perkin like cod. No panties? What the? Full commando, damn. Don't you have like chafing with that? No, it always. No, I don't have the equipment. 
Oh. Hold up, what? Yeah, exactly. You don't have the equipment to be full commando? <laughs> I thought that was like default. You just spawn into the world, you just have it, you know? I don't have the equipment to worry about chafing. <gasps> oh shit. Damn. Is that how you dance all the time? You just, you just, if there's a breeze, you just feel it. You're like, wow, that's, it's pretty cold out. What if someone walks in? What if one of your housemates walks in and they just see, you know, full on com commando, Call of Duty style? Like, they're just like, whoa, holy shit. And then you're just wiggling, you're just like, you know. I lock the door. Oh. Okay, I mean that that works, right? Val Val doesn't need to see that. Oh, do you live with Val Kara? She one of your housemates? Oh shit. I didn't know that. Wait, did she try to kill me <laughs> while you're streaming? <laughs> Out of nowhere, you just fucking <laughs> It just picks you up and just body slams you, but in VR you just see you like flying away. <laughs> oh, you got a streamer house? Holy shit! Wait, so who else is in the house? Who else? Can who else is in the house besides you and Valkara? So there's three, okay. And there's others, but we don't talk about those. Oh, okay. You don't want to say? Okay, don't worry. So it's just. We keep the pride. Oh yeah, yeah, of course. We are anonymous. Yeah, you have to wear you wear the anonymous masks from Viva from Vendetta, you know. Yeah, that's why you never know. But you're full commando, so like you just have the mask on. The mask, and that's why you never know who's who. You're like, wow, I don't know who this commando is. Who is that? Makes sense. Okay. Anyway, we'll take our chat question. Uh, Schaffmeister asks the, the most important question of this entire interview, uh, literally. Uh, how did you get so good at wiggling, XD? That's the most important question we all ask ourselves. From my mama? Mama, mama Moochie? I watch. You watch Mama Muchi and she teaches you how to dance? Mama Nichi. Nachi? Oh, oh, oh shit, oh. Oh, ma oh, Nachi, oh fuck. Sorry. The fucking, holy shit, I was like, who, who's the hell is Mama Muchi? Mama I was like, what the hell? Yeah, that's her, that, that, that's a letter. Old account. Oh, so they changed their name. They're not a mama anymore. We have some good friends who look after us until as well. And taught as well. Oh, so they taught you how to do the wiggles. How do you, how do you do the wiggles? You can teach me right now. How do you, how do you wiggle? I want to know. I can, I can, I can learn too. How do you do it? It's pretty easy, really? Oh shit, I don't have full body on though. It's pretty easy, you're in half body? Yeah, but I can, you know, you can t I can, I can look with my, I'm a visual learner. I can look with my eyes, I can play back the interview in my brain, and then I learn. And then you can hit the stonks? Yeah, that's right. You wiggle a lot as it is, Rebel, really? All right, I'm ready. All right, so you put the camera below you so it's an upwards angle. So then, yeah, okay. Okay, that's the first step. Mm-hmm. Okay. All right. Fit together. Yeah, your legs are together. Okay. And then it's just... Oh, shit. All right, where's my credit card? Where's my fucking wallet? Oh, so you go like this. Put your legs together. Oh shit. Oh my god, look, there's money just coming out of nowhere. What the hell? Oh my god. Look, ugh. here's my money. Here, here, here's all my money. Damn. Holy fuck. My tablet is going off in my ear. Uh oh. My sub. 
Wait, who subbed? <laughs> Wait, what? Someone <laughs> Wait, someone's <laughs> Oh shit. Damn. <laughs> it works. Look, you you don't even have to stream. You can just you just do it anywhere and it just works. Offline sub. Yeah, there you go. Nice. It subs when you're not streaming. I mean, I got it a few times. That's nice. Yeah, because you're dancing, you're demonstrating. So I want it next time in full body, which I don't know if it'll be tomorrow, but probably Monday. I'll I'll do that. I'll I'll look. I'll examine it, and then I'll. Well, tomorrow I might be busy, but um, unless I unless I stream early tomorrow, like in the afternoon or something, because uh, I guess some uh, some people are inviting me to like a like a world thingy. So, I'm going to have to DMCA. You're going to have to DMCA me because I'm wiggling? Oh, fuck. I knew it. I'm just not good enough. Fucking hell. Can you believe this guy? She's going to DMCA me. The, the thing, nice thing about the dance community, okay? The nice thing about the dance, no one, no one is protective about their dancing. They want to teach. No, that's fine. That's good. I'm trying to help everyone. Yeah, because gatekeeping's bad, okay? Chat, real talk for a second. Gatekeeping's bad, okay? Just let, let dancers do what they want to do. Be good for yeah, exactly. I get to learn how to wiggle. You know, gatekeeping's bad. Don't gate date. Don't <laughs> gatekeep. Teach people how to dance. Don't be like oh, you're not cool enough. Just be like, yo, let's dance. Let's hang out. You know. This clip will watch and to learn how to wiggle. That's right. I'm gonna be doing those moves soon. Be good for me. Yeah, exactly. Chat, do you have any more questions? Use the command X much by questions in the chat. Or if you just type in the chat, I can take it them as well that way. This, that's so embarrassing. Why is it embarrassing? You're a good person. You just want to teach people to dance. That shouldn't be embarrassing. That should empower you. You should be like, yeah, I want to teach people to dance. If you want to learn to dance, Dusty does lessons and that's really good. You should die? Oh yeah, I should die. I mean, you should really take them. I saw die first and I was like, what the fuck? <laughs> you should really take them out and she's really cool. I should take her out? Yeah, competition, right? And she's really cool. Holy shit, Shoto gonna with the gun. Oh my God. She's really cool, yeah. I Maybe I'll, maybe I'll stop by her uh, her uh, belly dancing classes. I'll get my boomer ass over there and be like, all right, show, show me how to dance. Everybody, where's my cane? <laughs> I, <laughs> hold up, my back's broken. <laughs> That's pretty hot. It's pretty hot that I'm old and broken. Nice. You're the first person to say that. That you would try? I mean, you never know. Maybe at some point I will. Never say never, you know, Justin Bieber, you know what I'm saying? Just, you just gotta try at some point in your life, you know? And if you, if you mess up, you just laugh it off. And then in six months, I wanna, I wanna be strong as fuck doing backflips, doing hip sways, and everyone's gonna be like, bro, you were laughing at me six months ago? Look at me now, bro. I'm the wiggle, I'm the wiggle king, bro. That's an important thing. Like, no one is born an expert. Everyone starts somewhere, and people are, are scared to take first step. Yeah, it makes sense. True. It's good you should try. Absolutely. It's good you should try. Absolutely. Oh, we got another question here. From Bill Lancer. Bill Lancer answers the question, Choto, do you have a favorite avatar that you don't stream with? Meaning an avatar you wouldn't you wouldn't use on stream. Meaning of avatar you wouldn't stream use on stream, yeah. Meaning 
Well, it can mean anything. It just means maybe you have a chill avatar you just don't use on stream. It doesn't have to be, uh, you know, the bad kind of avatars. I have, I have uh, a Gura avatar. Oh, like Gura the shark, the, the 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 VTuber. Okay, that eye dancing. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. But she definitely with the DMCA. <laughs> Did you definitely DMCA you? Yeah, I don't know who made those avatars. A lot of like. I don't, that's a weird area. There's a lot of like VTuber, or sorry, there's a lot of like people who make VTuber models, like 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 the Gura and Chodo and uh, all that stuff. So I don't know if it's like entirely legal to like, you know, use their avatars because it's without their permission. So I don't know how, what, what, what the situation with that is. So yeah, I'm, I'm not sure. Hollow Life, because Hollow Life, they got some deep pockets. I'm pretty sure they'd be pissed. They'd be like, what the fuck? They're, they're like, Gura will never wiggle. Why is this person named Choto Dragon wiggling as Gura? What the hell? This is bad for our brand. So, I don't know. But I guess that's just VRChat, right? They don't they don't care. They're just like, whatever, man. I'm gonna do what I want. So, I try not to stream with the mod avatar. It makes sense. Why Gura though? Is there a specific reason why why Gura? Is it just like a cool avatar? But I do cursed dreams. I do cursed dreams. Just in Discord, where I wear most random stuff. Oh, in Discord, you, you, you where you do like you do Discord streams. Oh, and then you do like uh, the random stuff. I see. Yeah, 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 that's where you like do all the random stuff. Fun with the community. They're more fun. Yeah, we watch movies and do stupid things. <clears throat> oh, nice. I mean, as long as people are having fun, right? We're very immature. I gotcha. Hell yeah. All right, next question. Hi, goodbye again. They're in my ISPs. Okay, so the next question here is from Dead Guy, my camera guy, who's over there. Uh, how do you two meet? And do you think it would be super hard to teach Rebel new moves? How do we meet? Well, I just slithered my way into those DMs, but no, really, how we actually really met was... Uh, wasn't it the first time you actually met at uh, the Friday night degen party thing? Party, yeah. Yeah, Lulu's party. That was the first time that I met uh, a Choto Dragon and it was with, um, who was there? It was you, I think Val, Anarchy. It was Anarchy, that was, that was something tell you what but yes we were i was just standing there in desktop and just talking to shout for like two hours and then they were just dming me in discord that's yeah we were, i don't maybe i don't know if it was two hours but it was definitely a while like it was like we sat in one place and everybody's like what the fuck what are you doing and we're just like we're just talking everyone else was drunk or on something and we're just having a casual conversation. It was like people like coming in the room and they're like, what are you doing? They're like, you're still standing here like two hours later. I was like, yeah, because I'm having a good talk with Turtle Dragon. You know? Yeah, we're just chilling. That's how we first met. Good times. Now look at us. Now we're having a conversation, but now you, you can talk in real time. See, it works. And that's how it happened. true story I don't remember who else I don't know if the was there I don't remember 
Are they remember? Were they there? I can't remember. There's a lot of people there. A lot of people. It was a blur, man. It was a blur. I was drinking a little bit. Uh, it was. It was a blur. Things happened. <laughs> It was, I was with the meat squad. Mute squad. Yeah, the meat squad. <laughs> the mute squad. Yeah, you were with the mute. I was all with the mutes. That's true. And if I can hear Val talk, be, uh, and it's, I can hear Val talk because she got such a big mouth that it makes it easier. Whoa. Let's see, you keep saying that, she might barge into this room and body slam you, RKO, you know what I'm saying? She might like, fucking slam you. Come right in. This is the winter. This is, if she enters my room locked, it's okay. What well, well, she breaks down the door? She She's a tough girl, I believe it. She's a Valkyrie. Makes sense to me. I got you. That's scary. A Scandinavian too scary. Is she tall? The Scandinavian like they're tall. Oh shit. Although she is, oh, if I said moaning, <laughs> as I was saying about she's a little girl, she is moaning. Oh my god. She is giant. Oh. Oh, I thought she was moaning. He needs to. You know, you know, she's seven foot tall. Damn, what the fuck, dude? She like uh, Viking lady, you know? It's all true, all canon. Oh shit. Okay, that's pretty cool. Oh, well, we got another question here from Slasher. Thanks for coming oh. over to me. Do you like what you see? Sorry, I got another Ooh. alert. Yo, Gothic Ivy, thanks so much for the right. I appreciate that. Slash us. Uh, Slasher Stabber 98 asked the question for Chodo. How well is her English going now? I think it's pretty good. What do you mean? We understand like 90% of what she's saying. I'm just filling in the blanks. It's okay. See, it's okay. I actually tested this program just to see how accurate it was. When I was talking using this program, it was accurate 99% of the time. But that's because I don't have an accent, so. If they understand me, that's a bonus. I feel that. Uh, Nina knows my struggle. So next stream, are you gonna use this closed caption or never again? I use it when I do horror. Oh, okay, or Minecraft. Yeah, because it's hard to type when you are being scared. Oh, Minecraft, excuse me. And screaming, yeah, I, f I believe it. Hundred percent. Okay. Not that I ever get scared. Oh, of course not. You're super loud when you get scared. Like, it, it, you, it's ear shattering, right? Like, it's just so loud. I feel it. Any more questions, chat? Well, in the meantime, if you have any more questions, type them in the chat or the Google document. But Choto, do you have any questions for me? We've been going for like an hour and a half ish. You're awake. You don't have to ask me, ask me any questions. You don't want to. I just let you know. I just ask in case maybe something in your brain's like, oh, I want to ask Rebel this really important question. No, it's cool. It's late for me. No, I got you. No, I'm I'm curious. Like how how the VR landscape has changed. How's the VR chat landscape changed since I pl started playing? Cause I feel, no, yeah. 
I am new. Yeah, you've only been playing for seven months. And I've been playing for almost four years. How's it changed? It's changed a lot. So, to give you perspective, I started playing VRChat December 10th, 2017. Um, this is back when there was like, there were some streamers, but it was like people with like five or 10,000 viewers, not like, you know, and, um, it was basically a very simple time. Like we didn't have like full body was a thing, but no one really used it because no one could see the potential in it. It was also expensive. Um, so no one really had, you had to have Vive 1.0 trackers. So I don't know how good those were, but no one really used them. And most people that played VR chat were desktop because VR was a like, you know, it wasn't common back then. So, yo, thanks for the fall. And it wasn't, it wasn't popular back then. So everyone was on desktop and anybody that had VR was like the cool kid. And you're like, you're like, look, I can dab. And people are like, whoa, it's so cool. What the fuck? Um, and avatars are very simple back then. Very, 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 very simple. It was just like MMDs. It was just TDAs. It was just like, playing as like Bart Simpson from the Simpsons. Like that was it. Like that was your avatar. You're like, look guys, I'm Bart. <laughs> like that was it, you know? But over time, people got better at making avatars and a full body became more popular and then streaming me started taking off. You know, I'll give, a, I'll give you a reference here. So like in November of 2017, there was only about 300 players. One month later in December, by the end of December of 2017, there was 20,000 players. That's right. So, thinking, why did the game blow up so much? What the hell happened? So, the reason why the game blew up so much was because of uh, streamers like Pokelols, uh, Team 5, which is a group I was a part of. Um, basically, Poke was like, think of him like as like the chauffeur for like bigger streamers. So, like, let's say if anyone here like watches like a big streamer like Shroud or Summit or Lyric, people have 40,000 viewers. Uh, they would contact Poke and be like, yo, what's this VR chat game? Can you show me around? And he'd be like, yes. And then he would show Lyric who had 40,000 viewers uh, around VR chat. And then if there's 40,000 people watching and people find out that the game is free, they're gonna start playing too. So a lot of people would, would start playing because of, of the bigger streamers or YouTubers as well. PewDiePie played uh, VR chat back in uh, December and, and November of 2017 as well. So there's a lot of uh, people like that. There was James Key, if anyone knows James Key here in my chat or watching, uh, I've interviewed him twice. James Key uh, made a series called VR Chat in a Nutshell, which was basically him just playing VR Chat and then people would just like show off their avatars and just general silliness. What is the... I think he can hear you. What James Key? James Key can hear me. I think my. My tax started to hear you, because I was quiet. Oh, cause, oh, sorry. I was talking and like it. I could, sorry, I, I got what you're saying. Um, but yeah, so like James Key and stuff like that. Um, made a series called VR Chat Nutshell. So that brought a lot of eyes onto the game. Um, and then by the basically by the end of or early 2018 there was 20,000 people like imagine this game going from like 200 300 people to 20,000 now obviously it didn't stick around 20,000 people just showed up for the big streamers you know the hype game the trendy game for the month um within like two or three months uh, like let's say March of 2018 the game went down to like 7,000 viewers but still a lot that's still a lot of people that stuck around um the biggest thing I would say was the content back then was very simple like we didn't even have cameras, just to let you know. Like we didn't have that. If you stream this game, everything was in first person. So how did you wiggle? You didn't. Nobody was wiggling. No one had full body. Like, no one really had full body. Everyone was in half body. They're sitting in their chair, they're lazy boy like this. They're like, hey guys, what's going on? <laughs> hey, you wanna hang out? <laughs> their hands like look raptor mode. Like that that was it. The, I mean, the fun was basically just exploring worlds. Like, that was it. Like, imagine, like, every day in VRChat, only, like, two or three worlds would, would get uploaded daily. And we don't know how good these worlds are. So, like, imagine, like, 
if you and like 10 friends, you go to this new world, you know nothing about it. And that's what, that, that was the content. You're like, oh shit, new world got updated in VR chat. Let's go check it out. And that's what you would do. Or you just improv, like role play. Like uh, there was a room, there was a world called courtroom. And it was just like a real courtroom. And then the back room, you can spawn props, like a gun or, or a knife or whatever. And you can just have like fake like court cases. So that's what uh, that's what we would do. We would have people do little fake little like skits, like oh I'm the I'm the lawyer, I'm the judge. You're you're accused of uh, head patting a lolly, dude. Oh shit, you know like whatever. <laughs> or like oh shit that avatar is too thick, you're under arrest or whatever. That that was the role play. That's what it was, and you know that's what we would do every day. Every day it was that, or we played a. Uh, Battle Disc, because Battle Disc used to be around back then. Or, uh, yeah, I see your mouse on the screen, so you know. Um, so you had Battle Disc, you had Steel and Gold, and uh, Capture the Flag. That's that's what we had, yeah. The Mirror Dwelling wasn't really a thing. Back then, um, there was mirrors, obviously, but they weren't in every world. Mirrors were, like, typically only in Avatar worlds. So you went to a world to just pick an avatar and then have a mirror to obviously test it. And that was it. Mirror dwelling wasn't really a thing. Like it, the content was always first person, just hanging out with friends, fucking around. But then the mirror dwelling happened and then the game went downhill. Right guys? <laughs> does the mute, does the mirror age still go on? Like people, I don't know when it started, but I definitely think when the cameras came out, it definitely um, got more people into looking at mirrors and, uh, you know, it's because people are like, oh, I want to see myself in third person. Well, the best way to do this is stand in front of a mirror. And I guess you could say, you know, you want to look like a hot anime girl. I mean, why stand? you got to stand in front of a mirror to look at yourself all day, right? Pizza Uno. Yeah, pizza's pretty good. And I mean, that's that's pretty much the, the, the short, like, short form. Of, I mean, the story I would tell you is probably like five hours long. Like, there's way more details than that. But that's just kind of like the rough form of it. Like, early days of VRChat was kind of just a very simple time. Very simple avatar, simple worlds, no game modes, no really mirror dwelling. I mean, there was some, but not really. You know, you would go to Publix and people wouldn't know you were streaming. And you just have a fun time. And, you know, as time went on, people found out people are streaming more and more and more. And then... Um, I guess you could say, um, back then when I first met people, they, they knew nothing. So people are very genuine. I feel like as time went on, people became less genuine because you don't know if the person wants to be your friend because you're a streamer. Do you want to be because you're a friend because you have a lot of viewers or they want to become your friend because you know, someone who's a big streamer. Uh, I've had that happen to me, uh, three years ago, three and a half years ago. Very quick story. Um, when I first got into VR chat, <clears throat> in the first month i uh i met lyric he had forty thousand viewers like i said earlier and he was streaming vr chat and i was in a random mmd nightclub it was mmd nightclub to like 2.6.5 or some shit like that it was really old world and um yeah that's fucking closed captions translating what i'm saying and uh, i was <laughs> i was in this club and uh lyric was streaming and then like oh, like, thanks for coming over to yo miyoshi do you like thanks so much see? for the raid Ooh. dude we're getting a lot of raids tonight yo i appreciate it thank you so much miyoshi for the raid slash us we're uh interviewing uh choto dragon just to catch you up and the closed caption is what she's saying by the way anyway like i said so i went to the this mmd nightclub and um lyric was there streaming forty thousand viewers and uh everybody was just like crowding around him because you know he was streaming with so many viewers and he he didn't really mesh with a lot of the people there because people are like stream snipe like oh hey you're a lyric i'm yo you're a big streamer i was just chilling and he actually went up to me and was like oh you're because at the time i had a kenny avatar so i was like oh, i was like oh you're you kenny from the walking stay dead away, huh keep coming back for more yo prometheus thanks for the three months prometheus and, underscore um, i'll just resubscribed for three months he went up to me it was like oh you're pretty cool he added me as a friend and uh the, the, the bad part of the story is that once he added me, a bunch of people, I'm not joking you, this is this is so messed up, but people started DMing me and were like, oh, Rebel, I saw that Lyric added you. Can you uh, can you invite Lyric? Can you make a world and invite Lyric to it so I can meet Lyric? I was like, what the fuck? What? 
Wh what? Like they basically like my friends at the time, like four years ago, were like, "Oh, Lyric added you. Can you can you get Lyric into a world of me so I can meet Lyric and be in front of his forty thousand viewers and shut my channel out?" Yeah, I'm not joking. That actually happened. Yeah, yeah, I'm not joking. Like I, that, people did that. I was like, "Holy shit, dude, relax, dude." You know that if you just act casual and just don't care, then maybe Lyric would actually add you. Like, I didn't do anything. I was just like, hey, what's up? And he added me because I was just chill. Can you talk to you? That's cool. Uh, he doesn't talk to me anymore. Like he only played for like the two days he played or whatever. But the, the point that I'm trying to get to the story here is that like people started acting less genuine towards me because they saw that I was with a big streamer. So they were trying to use me as a stepping ladder to get to the bigger streamers. And that made me really upset. You know, this happened nearly four years ago. So obviously I've learned a lot since then and how to deal with that stuff. Cloud chasing, absolutely, yeah. And I think the I think the best part of the story is that um, Lyric was going through public world, which means that technically anyone can join, right? So uh, Lyric uh, dropped a portal. I, I was with them, so we went for the portal and the guy who wanted to cloud chase joined off of me because it was a public. Because we didn't have statuses back then, like like uh, social statuses, you couldn't like be busy or whatever. So um, so the guy joined off of me, and then immediately was like, "Lyric, lyric, lyric! Oh my god, I'm gonna say this funny joke, funny funny joke!" And then lyric immediately just blocked him. I laughed so fucking hard. Like yeah, he, this guy was cloud chasing, trying to get the attention of, of lyric, and then lyric was just like, "No!" And then just literally blocked the guy. I laughed so fucking hard. Justice was served that day. That's what you get for cloud chasing. I have the same problem. I have Ron, I have Ron always cloud chasing. Damn. Yeah, I mean, it's funny because like there was like 30 other stream snipers that were in this public lobby, but the one person who actually was trying to cloud chase and asked me to cloud chase Lurk was only he only blocked him out of the whole 30 people so like i thought that was just i thought that was funny as fuck i was like that guy got it dude he got he deserved it you know but yeah that's my story of an old vr chat four years ago basically anyway next question here dead guy asks the question do you do you both have any future plans for your stream oh i've already explained my story but i want choto to explain you know future plans for you Yeah, lots. We have a whole timeline plan, so it's pretty big. Nice. That's the whole thing. We'll never, uh, we're never content, so we keep working. Sophie, fun. Should be fun. Oh, should be fun. So they have a lot planned. It's all secret stuff. There's a group. There's a group of us. They're all working together, and you want to have like a lot of content, but it's all it's all hush hush. You gotta keep watching to figure out. I got gotcha. you. Yeah, is no point to me saying everything has. Uh, half the stuff won't be working. Half the stuff will be wrong. Okay, that's no worries. It just means that, you know, you're working on something. Always a plan. I gotcha. Uh, next question we got here from uh, R4K. I pronounce like Rack, Rack B Tower. Uh, when uh, Choto is, when is Choto gonna race the mods? Yeah, when are you gonna race your mods in your racing car game, and you're gonna beat them all? We'll play in December. Hey, that's only like less than two weeks away. And I will win. Hey, there you go. That's the spirit. What games are we gonna play again? I don't know, Mario, Mario Kart, Forza, Need for Speed. I think it was America. 
Okay. Nice. Super fun. Sounds like fun to me, honestly. Nice. Nice, nice. Well, um, unless anybody has any other questions, I think we're going to start wrapping up here. It's been almost uh, two hours, just to let you know, since the start of the interview. Does anyone else have any... Um, Anyone else have any questions they want to ask Chodo or myself? Anyone? If not, we'll have uh, Chodo start wrapping up. And then I'll end my stream and we'll raid someone that you want. Uh, you get to choose who I raid, Chodo. You get to decide. Yes, who? Who crashing? Who crashing are you? No. Okay. I'll type it? Sure. They won't see it, but I'll read it if you type it in uh, Discord. I'll type it tonight. Sure. Oh, I mean, who you're raiding? You'll type who I'll raid? I'm deciphering things, chat. Are we crashing? No, we're fine. But anyway, in the meantime, while she's typing, uh, if you haven't already, hit the follow button, ladies and gentlemen. Almost at 25,000 followers. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed today's uh, interview. Check out Choto Dragon, twitch.tv slash Choto Dragon. Check out our Twitter or uh, Twitch, all that good stuff. Um, Crushin? Okay, we'll, we'll raid Crushin. If she's still alive when I end my stream in like a couple minutes. But, um, yeah, it's been fun. You guys, did you guys enjoy this interview? Did you guys have a lot of fun? Yeah, you guys enjoy everything that we've been doing here? It was fun, right? We had a fun time. We were deciphering what, what Choto Dragon was saying the entire time. I think we did pretty good, you know? This was a chill interview. It was, yeah, it was a lot of fun. This is interview number 270, by the way. That's how many I've done. That's a lot. Yikes. Yeah, that's why I say it too. Yikes. That's crazy. It was, it was fun trying to figure out what they were saying. Yeah, of course. Thank you, everyone. You're very kind. I don't know what I'm saying. Me neither. Thank you. Do you have any last words, any last statements you want to say, Chota? Anything, anything you want to say? And then I'll, I'll wrap it up, and then we'll raid a uh, crushing. <coughs> well, I'll take a drink. Just keep being supportive, chat. It's amazing, like. Uh, just, sorry, like, not just me, but everyone, like, you're so cool, so cool, thank you. Nice. Nice. And thank you, Rebel. Well, I appreciate that. Thanks for stopping by. This is different. This is very different. Hey, different is always good. It was a lot of fun, you know? I had a lot of fun with this interview, you know? It's something different, right? Um, the Serbian? Yeah, I'm Serbian. You're right, how did you know? It's nice to mix it up. Absolutely. I feel that. But uh, anyway, I'll wrap it up here. So you don't have to embarrass yourself with the, the English stuff anymore. So anyway, guys, hope you guys enjoyed tonight's uh, interview of Shoto Dragon. Hit her up. Go to, go to twitch.tv slash Shoto Dragon. You're going to be streamed probably another day, like tomorrow or something, or maybe next week, whenever you next stream. Go 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 hit her up. Ask her how to ask her how to wiggle. Ask her how to teach you guys how to wiggle. She's a teacher. She'll teach you how to wiggle. 
Um, hope you guys enjoy everything. Thank you much for the falls. Thanks much for the raids. Thanks much for the hosts. Thanks much for the uh, follows, the subs, all that good stuff. Uh, I don't know if I'll be streaming tomorrow. It depends how I'm feeling, but I'll definitely stream probably Monday. Uh, I had a lot of interviews this week, so my brain's kind of uh, toast. But um, yeah, a lot of fun. Thank you so much again to Chodo Dragon for coming on my show. I'm your host, Own Rebel, and I'll see you guys another time. And uh, Chodo, if you want to stick around for just one minute, we'll take a photo together. But uh, yeah, we're going to go raid uh, Crushin and uh, send uh, Crushin our some, some love. All right, see you guys later. Bye bye. Peace out. send you guys to her and she is still streaming <laughs>